the, 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 the reason I fell out of love with my old previous discipline is because there exists an intellectual boundary. So once you are like working in the field or working as a designer, um, three, four years down the line or five, 10 years down the line, you, you kind of hit this knowledge barrier where there is really, really not much new things you are supposed to learn after that. Uh, so the procedures are mostly standards, the theories are standards, there are nothing groundbreaking happening over there. But unlike uh, the technological frontier, so this is not only just for Bitcoin, but this is common for any kind of technological um, technological industry or any kind of industry where frontiers are being broken every instant of time. Bitcoin is a very extreme example of such industry. Uh, so here what happens is like as as I can see like the I, I, I cannot see a possible knowledge boundary anywhere near my like long term horizon. I do not see myself like stop learning anytime soon. Uh, so that's the thing that catches my breath. Um, and in, in case of Bitcoin, it goes to extreme because Bitcoin is not just technology. It's just it, it is basically culmination of very different kind of disciplines, very different kind of subjects that people previously thought are completely unrelated to each other. But after Bitcoin, we suddenly realize like, oh my God, these all these things are related and they can be combined together in a design that is like a beautiful design uh, that Satoshi made and uh, create some kind of monetary system for the world. And that has technological implication, economic implication, political implication, and social implication on our world.